The sister of a Youngstown murder victim says she's finally seeing some closure now that the man who committed the crime has been sent to prison. First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti has been following the death of Shannon Graves since her body was discovered and was in court today for a sentencing. For the first time, the brother and sister of Shannon Graves confronted the man who killed her and asked for justice. Arturo Novoa was back in court this afternoon for sentencing. Last month, he pled guilty to 43 counts, including murder and engaging in a pattern of corrupt activity in the beating death and then dismemberment of Shannon Graves back in February of 2017, and then leading a conspiracy to hide and dispose of her body. This afternoon, the victim's siblings told the judge Novoa needs to go away. We're here fighting, hoping that we can get as much time as possible for him to go away. We don't want him ever to be out. We don't want him to ever be able to hurt anybody else. This afternoon, for the first time, prosecutors in this case laid out the conspiracy that was mentioned about this crime and how it all came together. We'll have some of those highlights coming up at 6. In Youngstown, Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.